I'll, I'll, the first question I'll ask you, but is just the one I just mentioned. Um, how different does it feel, if at all? What you know? What were your thought when you woke up this morning? You knew the job was different. Yeah, sure. There's no question about it. I. Um, it's different, but as you can tell from looking at my desk this morning, uh, this is the way it looks every morning, <laughs> and that'll continue to be. I have so much to do, and uh, and um, you know, so much to look forward to that I'm we're beginning almost to move in that, and I'm still going to stay connected with baseball as the commissioner emeritus. So um, it's busy, but is it different? Yes, and it's really been emotional and. All these messages I'm getting every day, uh, either by phone or mail, it, it's really quite the, rewarding. The last two weeks, all of these um, dinners that you went to where different groups um, you know, uh, paid tribute to you, I would imagine it, it, it stayed emotional there for several days. Um, very emotional, very emotional. Uh, first in Phoenix, huge dinner. Everybody in baseball, plus a lot of former owners, a lot of Hall of Fame players. I mean, it was really. Then the scouts, huge dinner in L.A., which was really emotional. Then on to St. Louis, uh, another standing room only dinner in a wonderful city that I really love, and um, great emotion. And then Saturday night in New York, couldn't have been too much more emotional at the end. He's, you did not know Rob Manfred was going to present that award. I did to not. You, did you? No. What, what did that mean to you? Well, it meant a great deal. It was very emotional, and um, you know, I got it all done, and uh, my speech right here. The audience was—you could tell there was a lot of emotion in the room, and. Um, so I added a little line at the end, just came off the top of my head, Tom. I mean, uh, and um, tell me that line, which which inspired, I think, more uh, uh, more emotion. In fact, I had many people talk to me about it, including Sandy Koufax. But um, I just said uh, in closing, or, or as I finish, uh, this is one of those rare occasions in life where you've seen a little boy's dreams come true. That was it. And you closed that way, it got a big hand, didn't it? And a long standing ovation. Yeah. I mean long, very emotional. Yeah. So the commissionership officially changes to New York now with Rob Manfred. Yeah. But here you are still at your office. Oh yeah, and I'm going to be here for a long time, so yeah. yes. I mean, there are a lot of things that have changed, a lot of things that aren't going to change. <laughs> so we have a little of both. So it's. But I've had a lot of emotion, a lot of phone calls yesterday, a lot of messages, mail. I gotta, I'm gonna have to get through all this mail. You're a baseball lifer. It would have been hard to quit cold turkey and, and just not do anything in baseball. Well, you know, I, I, they kidded me for a lot of years. Um, you know, I said I was done, and then they renewed me again and extended me four times. Now think about that. I originally thought I was gonna do this for five and a half years, and that was gonna be it. So here it is, 50, you know, here it is, 23 years. Well, what was it you told your wife, Sue, uh, when you first Got off the plane and uh, day Robin Yount got his 3,000 hit with George Bush, Tom Werner, and uh, Bobby Brown, Dr. Brown. And she said, what does this mean? I said, two to four months, don't worry about it. <laughs> so that's one of those infamous quotes that, that lives in infamy. It's How many times has she brought that up that she said two to four months? Well, after a thousand, I quit counting. <laughs> but she's enjoyed it, too. Sure, every, the family had, no question. Yeah. So you, you mentioned your family um, in your speech in New York Saturday night. Without them, it's not possible, is it? The support? No, because this is a tough life, baseball a tough life, you know. As you well know, you know that from your own experience. You have to travel a lot. and. You're gone a lot, and the pressures, especially in a job like commissioner job, morning, noon, and night, seven days a week. Right. And um, you can remember, even on our walks on Sunday, I'd be worrying and getting calls. And yeah. So, so no, all that's important. Did those uh, last question? Did those 23 years go by in a blur, or or how would you characterize the way that time went? Well, it went fast. There's no question. My whole career, after all. When you think about this time, my career started in 1964 when the Braves were threatening to leave Milwaukee. 
So here we are 51 years later. Who could have dreamed in 1964, I'm a kid trying to save a local team, they leave, that the journey that I was on would take the place of Who could have ever believed that? You have trouble believing it yourself. I do, bit, you? sometimes, yeah. I mean, you've lived it, you know, it's true, but but you've amazed yourself. No question you? about it, no question about it, yeah, yes.